Hi friends! Tonight on Doodle the Travel Bug, we travel to the Hudson Valley in New York to experience the great jack-o'-lantern blaze. Thousands of hand-carved pumpkins illuminate this magical location. So, where are we going today? We are going to Blaze in the Hudson Valley in upstate New York. Blaze? That sounds illegal in some states. We're going to Blaze. It's a jackal. It's like 7,000 carved pumpkins. Um, I'm going to count them. Yeah, see if they're... Yeah. <laughs> see if they're all there. My, so, my money back. I wanted to go to this for years, so I'm really excited they're putting it on this year. So That'll be fun. All right, let's go. The Great Jack-O-Lantern Blaze is a production of the historic Hudson Valley, and it's located just eight miles north of Sleepy Hollow. Yeah, that's Sleepy Hollow. The historic Hudson Valley also does tours of the same cemetery included in the legendary story, and it's also where the writer, Washington Irving himself, is laid to rest. But that's another adventure. Today, we're going to see over 7,000 hand-carved, illuminated pumpkins set against the historic grounds of Van Cortlandt Manor, and we can't wait. What do you think, Marco? I think it's very cool. Yeah? And right now, it looks like the Headless Horseman uh, uh, is up next. Should we go check it out? Yeah, what's your favorite part so far? Statue of Liberty. Statue of Liberty? That was way cool. So, All right. ready? Yep, let's, let's go. go. So on September 10th, they carve about, it's either two or 4,000 pumpkins. Some of these are silicon that they've done with art, that artists have done over the years, but for like two weeks, they start carving and setting up structures and doing all these pumpkins. Very cool.
What was your favorite part? Talk loud. A kitty. The kitty. Oh, the kitty pumpkins. Those were cool, weren't they? Yeah. Yeah. Was there any of it was scary? Yeah. A little bit scary? Yeah. Only a kitty. Only the kitties. Yeah. yeah. All right. For more unique travel shows, like and subscribe to see where Doodlebug goes next.